field exercises, PT, and ground pounding. But soldiers of Charlie Company, 1st to the 503rd Infantry, have one vital mission during war steed, reconnaissance. They carry everything to survive and fight. A typical rucksack contains a change of clothes, cold weather gear, waterproof boots, weapons cleaning kit, ammunition, food and water, and can weigh a back-breaking 120 pounds. The soldiers also carry weapons. It can be a 7.5-pound M16 or a 25-pound M47 anti-tank weapon. A typical recon mission can take them and all their gear 20 miles on foot. They gather information at the most basic level, out of view of the enemy. When we go out to conduct a mission, whether it be day or nighttime, recon, whatever the case may be, we're looking for the enemy weak points. We're looking for places that we can infiltrate. Some of the usual weak points is guards on sleep, sitting there eating MREs, not just chilling. We look for things like that. Uh, breaks in the wire, we look for places that the enemy thinks that we are not coming, which is where we normally go. To avoid being heard, they communicate with slight bird calls and silent arm signals. To avoid being seen, they sometimes low crawl for hours. Theirs is the first step to enemy destruction. Information on whereabouts, weaponry, and enemy troop strength gets passed to the Tactical Operations Center. Battle plans are drawn there. According to Lieutenant Michael Velasco, War Steed is the most realistic training for the 1st to the 503rd. From Chor 1 Valley, Specialist April Drager, AFKN News.